Nicola Sturgeon um, it emerged during the week that she's created a company, I think, for her outside earnings. Um, jazzily titled Nicola Sturgeon Limited. Dougie, is this another sign that she's um, headed for the exit door in terms of Hollywood? Yeah, I mean, absolutely. I think um, a, a stint on Lost Women awaits maybe as a regular panellist. Um, but I don't Strictly think that was any of it. What's that? Strictly Come Dancing? Strictly. I'm a celeb. Um, you know, I I'd feel sorry for the bugs in the box where, but, you know, um, I was quite taken with the fact that at Company's House, she had listed her, uh, her nationality as British. Um, Scott, uh, Alex Salmond um, managed to list his as Scottish for his company for the same reason. So uh, um, I don't know how that might go down with uh, with her with her supporters but yeah i mean i mean, I mean definitely it's obviously it's obviously she's got, she's got uh, one eye on the exit to use the football analogy you know she's um our contracts up in the summer and she's just going through the motions I, you know i would be amazed if she hasn't already been approached even if she doesn't admit it by um you know the people like uh, strictly come dancing and i'm a celebrity she's got a book in the pipeline, um, it's uh, looks like that has certainly been a six-figure deal, and um, I think that there will be other things in the offing. Um, I think that Nicholas Orr would have been in more demand if it hadn't been for the issues that have emerged with the SNP during her leadership. Um, but I think, if anything, those issues are the things that are probably going to make the type of activity she'll pursue through this company more likely to be where her career will be going in the short term.